hello to all today we are going to discuss about some mcqs which are based on the biomolecules uh, i am discussing today some questions which are based on ncert and these questions are very important because many students are facing problem related with this topic because many times in particularly in the neat exams the questions are asked from the biomolecules and the students are not able to do that questions so please concentrate on this aromatic amino acids amino acid is aromatic amino acid is as we know very well that there are 20 amino acids but if you see the ncert on page number 144 then you will see that there are three examples given for the aromatic amino acid tyrosine phenylalanine and tryptophan means aromatic amino acids are of three types tyrosine phenylalanine and tryptophan so answer must be all of the above aromatic amino acid is tyrosine phenylalanine as well as tryptophan so the question number 1 must be having the answer d okay second question arachidonic acid has how many carbon atoms arachidonic acid has how many carbon atoms so you must know that this arachidonic air that is arachidonic acid is having 20 carbon atoms how many are there 20 carbon atoms are there and if you will be viewing the page number 144 of the ncert you will get the answer that it is written that arachidonic acid has 20 carbon atoms okay so the answer of question number 2 must be c now coming to the question number 3 lecithin now what is lecithin lecithin is basically what a phospholipid okay so lecithin is a constituent of lecithin is a constituent of nuclear membrane cell membrane cell wall or nucleus so always remember that lecithin is a constituent of cell membrane on page number 144 of ncert it is clearly mentioned that lecithin is a constituent of cell membrane so question number 3 is having the answer b cell membrane now most abundant protein in animal world remember the question is that most abundant protein in the animal world is rubisco collagen glycogen or none of the above so you must know that most abundant protein in animal world is collagen question number 4 must have the answer b it is clearly mentioned on page number 148 of ncert that collagen is the most abundant protein in the animal world so question number 4 is having the answer b next which of the following category of secondary metabolite is correctly matched with the suitable example so there is a table given in ncert on page number 146 okay now on that the question is asked here which of the following category of secondary metabolites is correctly matched with the suitable example the very first one is in the column 1 the given is alkaloids and the combination in the column 2 is morphine and codeine pigments abrine and resin drugs lemon grass oil and lecithin vinblastin and vincristin you can see on page number 146 that the correct match of the column 1 and 2 is of the alkaloids because two alkaloids morphine and codeine are given in the ncert okay in this particular table so the question number first must have the answer a must have the answer a question number 6 building block of nucleic acid building block of nucleic acid a small part of nucleic acid is given in the ncert class 11th in the biomolecule chapter and you must know that the building blocks of nucleic acid is nucleic acids are of two types dna and rna and we must know that the nucleic acid the building blocks of the nucleic acid means from which the nucleic acids are made so you must know that dna and the rna are the polymers of the nucleotides means the building blocks of the nucleic acid are the nucleotide okay so question number 6 must have the answer a 
Fine. So in this video, we have discussed some important questions related to the MCQs on the biomolecules. In the next video also, we will be coming with few more uh, chapters of the NCRT so that you can do proper practice for your exams. Thanks a lot.